Okay, here's an idea. This is really risky, but what if I push into this WT with HE loaded? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. That's such a good idea. Okay. Come on. Go in. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Slumming Rush. Today, I want to play something that's high tiers. I really enjoy high tier gameplay. I think it's a lot more fun and diverse than the derp guns at low tiers. You know, it's fun occasionally, but right now I'm not in the mood for it. So what I'm going to be doing today is we're going to be playing basically the tank with the highest alpha damage in my garage, the Object 703 version 2. The problem with this map is that the average heavy tank player will go into the mid. Now, why that is... I think it's just because it's right in front of you and the average player doesn't think. I, I have no idea why the average player would ever bring a tank here. If you look at it, the exit of this position sucks. There's no way to escape it. You have to go up through a ramp like it's open field to cross. It's a really bad play. Um, there's no reason to go mid on this map. Now, luckily, none of our team is, but unluckily, they're all camping here, so that sucks. I can't take... Normally, in this situation, I'd want to go K3, but they've got two already. I'm going to be the only player up here. Our whole team is camping. It's probably a lot smarter for me just to chill back here and kind of see what happens. Now, yeah, with the way this team is, I wanted to get up here and put side shots into the mid, but that's not going to happen. So I'm going to point my ass towards the enemies, and we'll see what this PTA spots. Alright, so this PTA is stock. Normally you don't find that great of players using stock tanks. There is an enemy PTA here. Put one shot into him. Do I wait for this to fully load? I, I think he's going to chill here. I might as well just wait two more seconds. Okay, guess that was a mistake. I think it's right click. No, how do you... Shit, I don't have the double mouse thing configured. Okay, so we have everything configured. This, um, well, I don't think this position is going to last. So I'm going to fall back. Dude, this team is eight. I have to fall all the way back and get as already safe as I possibly can. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, so this team is absolutely garbage. Um, I don't have the view range to play this side of the map, really, alone. I kind of need someone to scout for me, and there's no one. So falling back to a position where I don't rely on my view range... <laughs> basically here i think is key and what i can do is i'm not going to be swatting this but in a couple seconds i can start scouting it if that makes sense what i want that to have happen is i want the enemies to get up to here so okay imagine if you were the enemies if i got spotted here and you were back here you would just sit there and snipe me but if i hide here i can set a bit of a trap let them get close and then i can try to spot them and you know i can spot people like this pta here and that's going to get me the spotting damage i'm kind of looking for now i'm gonna oh god this guy I think I'm going to get yellowed here, aren't I? Okay, at least I'm getting some spotting damage. Okay, these guys have to cross over a ridge, which is good for me, and I can take hull down over here. My salvo button isn't working. Definitely not optimal. We've got an IS-22 sniping at us. Okay, that's one shot. If these guys push into me, they're dead, so I'm really happy to be here. Okay. You'd think I would be getting all the spotting damage here, but I guess not. Okay, that's some spotting. That's good. Lance and flanking this guy. Okay, that's one more shot of damage. Cool, Lanson should get the kill. And then this game is nowhere close to over, but I have to watch out for Artie. So hopefully Artie doesn't manage to hit me. I'm going to fix my control situation. We're going to start pushing in. Okay, and now we're exactly where I wanted to be at the beginning of the game. And oh my god, we have this guy's flank. Perfect. Okay, so here we are. Come on. Oh, what? Dude. <laughs> That is so annoying. I can maybe get eyes in a sec here. I don't really want to. It will. Oh shit, this ISU. Let's see what he finds. Okay, now this IS-22 has to wait 24 seconds before I'm reloaded, so I should be good. 
Okay, so we're in a really interesting position. It's basically the type of, this is the situation where you will probably, the impact that I have on this game will win or lose us the game in my opinion. So what I'm gonna do is I think we have shots, we do have safe shots on this IS-2 too. The problem is if you look at my team, this, I, this WT is the only player who is shot supporting me. So if I get spotted consistently, I'm gonna start getting clipped. Now spotting this WT, see, just fuck. Like, and no one's shooting him. So we've got this guy who's full HP here and I'm getting myself killed effectively to get zero spawning damage. It's not worth spotting this WT, and I think I need to stay alive for a bit longer. So what I'm going to do is we're going to chill looking for this IS-2-2. Probably didn't need to heal that stun there, but whatever. And I'm going to see if someone lights him. If someone doesn't light him, I'm not pokey on this WT anymore, because this guy, his position is so bad. <laughs> he has no shots on anything, so I'm not going to be able to do anything. Now, See what the team finds. Alright, he's just blind firing. Cunt. And this grill might kill himself here, which would really suck. Looks like he's insistent. And can we land a double shot? This guy knows it's coming. You can see that. Is he going to point his tank to the right yet? I think this guy's going to stay here until I pretty much fire. Give him a couple seconds, and then... Yeah, those went in. That's exactly what we needed. So get those shots in. Perfect. Hopefully they penned. That'd be so cool. And sense flanking. This is good. We kind of have them boxed in, but they have so much HP that I have to be careful. So so I'm poking right now because this GW, is. there's no way he's looking for me. Okay, here's an idea. This is really risky, but what if I push into this WT with HE loaded? Oh shit. Oh my god. That's such a good idea. Okay. This WT has no idea that I'm coming. I've got 14 seconds left on this reload. And, uh, well. <laughs> oh boy, am I ready. I penned that IS-2 by the looks of it. Fantastic. He's dead. And then we've got this WT right here. Who's not going to be facing. This guy's going to have no idea. Come on, go in. Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. <laughs> We've got an STRV in front of us and this uh, FV4000 whatever. Maybe one of these will go in. I'll take it. Yes, it does. And we get damage blocked. That's fantastic. We're up to 3k damage minimum. And I'm going to play the single shot game from here on out. This FV might poke on me. Kind of doubt it. And we'll just try to keep this guy lit for already. This guy bounces. That misses, fine. And this guy's never going to pen me as far as I'm concerned with my uh, turn armor here. This is one of those positions that's so good in Russian heavies, but hey, this guy fires. He's got HE loaded. Should probably have heat for this guy. And at least we're going to get some spotting damage. That's 200 spotting damage on the STRV. STRV is looking away. I've got heat. Hopefully this one goes in. Yeah, no... Okay, he's trying to kill me. He's really trying. HE got me. Okay, well, we should get some spotting damage if already hits him again, and that will be the game here. Incredible. <laughs> this WT, this full HP guy should win the game for us, at the very least. Oh my god, I penned two blind shots on that IS-2-2. <laughs> 4k damage, all the credits, 70k credits, that's so good. This thing is so fun. <laughs> I was actually going to record a second game after this one, but the time is 10.54 my time, and I have to live stream in about an hour. So I have to go make a thumbnail, upload the video, and that's going to be just enough time. I've just edited the video, so I can't, I don't have any more time to record. I really want to say a huge thank you for watching this one. I'm going to be live streaming in basically the second. If you watch this whole video, I should be live when you're done. And um, yeah, feel free to say hi there, and I hope to see you around. Later, guys. Bye-bye.